and delete. <laughs> Nine Out here. I'm here today to talk to you about something very important in regards to Clash Royale. Best game ever created and the sporting world alike. And that is losing. And sometimes not only just losing, but losing streaks in general. We've all been there. To the point where you just want to destroy everything in sight. Throw your tablet. You stupid game. What the? And get rid of the game. And delete <laughs> altogether. But sometimes that just isn't the best solution to the problem. Okay? So we're going to talk about a few simple strategies that I use to try to keep myself grounded when I play. Looky here. If you want to take a look at my account here, uh, I am on kind of an epic losing streak. <laughs> One win away from Challenger 3. So pretty brutal. I've won, I've lost so many flipping games in a row, it's getting frustrating to the point where I just want to give up and quit. But that's not what I'm going to do. So I'll take heed to my few simple uh, tricks or tips here that I normally go through when I am on a losing streak just like this one. Hey look, there's a draw. That's good. So number one, what you want to do, put the tablet, device, Apple product, or your phone down. That's right, go ahead and put it down. That's gonna be your best way to calm down, take a breather, and make sure that you get back on track so that you can start winning games again. Number two, what I do, make sure and drink a lot of water. If you drink a lot of water, your head's going to be super clear and you're going to be able to focus again on your game. Surprisingly enough, uh, playing Clash Royale is a little bit, uh, how do we say, hard on your brain, I guess. Having to react to all those opponent's moves and think about your own cards as well, it takes a toll on your brain. So you need to keep your brain well refreshed, well watered, and make sure you keep on playing. That way you have a clear picture of what's going on. Number three, what I do, sometimes you're just gonna wanna take a walk. <laughs> you know, go outside, go check, get some fresh air, go to the park, do whatever you do. Uh, maybe go to work right now since you should probably be doing that anyway instead of playing Clash Royale at home on the couch. You're probably gonna get fired. Anyway, so those are some simple things that I normally do when I'm on a crazy losing streak similar to this one that I am in right now. Very unfortunate is what it is, but we're going to keep on keeping on and we're going to keep playing. One more thing that I like to do is I like to play a training match. <laughs> training match? Well, I think I have a chance here. Let's do it. <laughs> oh, buddy, Trainer Gravy, you make my day. You make my day. Good luck to you, good sir. <laughs> I know it seems silly, but it kind of gives me some confidence that I need to be able to uh, keep on keeping on, I guess. Because <laughs> usually, I'd say at least half the time I win those. <laughs> maybe maybe not quite half. But it gives me a confidence boost, you know what I'm saying? So that's what you guys can do. Um, just some few tips or tricks to keep yourself level-headed in the game. And under no circumstances should you ever do anything that's going to affect you long term or your family or your friends i've seen some crazy things in the sporting world that have ruined people for lives for their entire life and uh now that clash royale is becoming more and more of an esport and more and more competitive it brings out the competitive nature in people and it seems to spark things in people that they didn't know they had um your real test in life is how you're going to handle adversity how you're going to handle things when you fail, when you drop out, when you when you lose, when you're not doing as well as you should be. How are you going to handle those situations? That's what's going to make you who you are and who you're going to become. So make sure you keep a level head when you're playing. <laughs> That's why I hate these emotes sometimes. That's what riles me up the most. <laughs> Getting BM. But keep a level head when you're playing. 
so that you can keep your cool and that you can come out on top when the going gets tough. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. So I totally beat this royal giant again. <laughs> uh, good times. Good times. Yeah. Yeah. Just smoked him with a set of mini skeletons. <laughs> it was great. <laughs> All right. So now that we're done with that little spill, <laughs> we're going to try and break this losing streak that I'm in. Holy cow, it is brutal. <sighs> but first, we're going to open up a magical chest. I was saving it for the uh, Mega Knight, which I did not win, of course, because I had crappy service all weekend and did not get a ton of chances to play. But it is what it is. I'm okay with it. Um, <laughs> I'll get it in a couple weeks, I guess, when everybody else does, so I'm not too worried about it. So we'll make that happen. That's a balloon. That's awesome. Okay. So let's get right into a battle here. Here's the deck that I'm using now. I was using bats in place of minions, but I did switch the minions out because everybody seems to be running Zap right now. And I think that is because, you know, bats are so prevalent in the arena right now. So we're going to run some minions and we're going to see if we can pull out a few victories. Now that I've taken a break, I've went on a walk, I've got some water in me. Hopefully, I can keep my cool while I play this game and not get too angry when they seem to have max barbarian board every two seconds every 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 single person i play seems to have max barbarians <laughs> very frustrating but i'm gonna roll with it because that's what we're gonna do okay so musketeer coming down the lane not too worried about it i may just take the damage because he does have a pump in the back he is pumping up and i may need to save myself for this golem coming down the lane of course level seven because why wouldn't it be my epics are all like level 5, of course. So he has a level 7 golem, which that's okay. We can deal with that just real quick here. We're going to throw a Pekka down. Um, he's going to throw a Mega Minion down. We're going to go ahead and zap. Oh, I shouldn't zap. Probably shouldn't zap. Whew, that's a problem. We're going to go ahead and go Ice Golem over here to extract. He knows I use my zap, so he's going to throw the bats down. It's okay. We have Ice Golem down. And. We will take out some musketeer in the back. Baby dragon is going to get a little damage on the tower. Not too concerned about it. Okay, Mal, I'm a little more concerned. Wow, that baby dragon did a lot of work to us. That's okay. That is okay. So here's the question here. Do we take out the pump with lightning? Or do we just go take out the tower real quick? Hmm. Let's see what he's got. I'm going to go take out the tower real quick with Hog Rider. Get him in there. And then we're going to go like this. Boom, boom, boom. What's he got for us? Nothing. Okay. So now what we can do is we can drop our mini pack in the back. We got a Mega Minion to distract over here. What? Did not see that coming. Stop him. There we go. Oh, no. I forgot. Slash damage. Not smart, guys. Not smart. Not smart at all. Uh, we are going to go another mini pack in the second round, too. <laughs> Look crap. I don't know that we're going to be able to stop this power from going down. He, looks like he already knows it's going down, so he's going on the other side already. <laughs> Smart guy. That's what I like about him. Um, boom. We'll go goblins just for fun. Make him really have to work for this other tower here. And then we are going to go... Um, boom, boom. Let's go. Oh, what? That was very unfortunate. Very... Oh, oh crap. <laughs> We're gonna go like this, just for fun, just to distract him. Oh crap, goblins. Dang it, splash damage. I keep forgetting. I keep forgetting. That's what he does. Um, so he's gonna go ahead and use a rocket, which is actually super smart right now. Um, I'm gonna use um, my mini pack, I guess. <laughs> oh my gosh, this losing streak is horrible. Horrible! I cannot get a win to save my life. Let's get into another battle here. Let's see if we can't pull this together. <laughs> I've got to snap this thing. I've got to snap this thing. I thought talking about it would make it better, but obviously I can't do anything to uh, make it better. Okay, so let's focus here. What are we going to do? Maybe switch decks. That's maybe what I need to do. I've been using this deck for... It did so good for me. It's been doing so good. It really has. Um, then all of a sudden I start like... I don't know, losing, hardcore. I need to throw Night Witch back. Oh, I dragged the goblins over there. They didn't drag correctly. I hate it when I miss a drag. Okay, so let's go like this. 
Where's my hog? Are we serious about my hog being clear on the bottom here? Um, I thought about lightning that. Actually, I might still. Let's go ahead. We're gonna lightning that. Boom, boom, boom. We might get another. Oh, my flip. Did I tell you? Did I have the worst luck. I'm not even kidding you. Um, he will take us out with the bats there. Not too concerned about it. We're gonna go ahead and we're gonna throw Mr. Hog in here. And then we will go zap that. Boom. Just for fun. Looks like we'll get a couple hits off. One or two. Goblins did actually a real good job. We're gonna distract these little goblins over here with the ice cream until we can get our goblins around. He's gonna zap our goblins just the same. This looks like a big zap fest going on. Now what do we gotta worry about? What do you got coming our way? Mm, that is a problem. Let's go minions and then hog rider. And then that should do pretty dang good here. And then we will zap whatever he's got coming our way. He's gonna throw I knew he had Pekka. Dude, I didn't know that, but I assume. So he's got Mega Knight Pekka deck. Ooh, this is gonna be brutal. This is gonna be brutal. Um, we gotta zap that. Boom, boom, boom. Gotta get this ice going down. There we go. My mini Pekka is doing a little bit of damage. Perfect. We were able to stop that Pekka. I know he's got Mega Knight. He's gotta have it, right? He's gotta have it. So this is great. This is great. Come on, come on, show me the money. I knew it, dude, I knew it. I absolutely knew it. So let's go like this. Let's go Minions. And we'll go Mega Minion right here. And then we'll go Lightning. Cause we gotta take that out. We need to zap that. We didn't need to zap that. Yeah, we did. That was cool. That was a good zap, actually. Um, now we just gotta get our Hog Rider in there somehow. Without pissing off his, uh... What do you call that thing? Heck it. Good. We gotta do that. So let's go like this. Let's try this this time. Ice Golem over here. Um, Mega Minion. Here we go again. This is good. This is good. I'm okay with this. This is gonna... We're gonna defend this just fine. Oh crap. No we're not. We're gonna zap that. I'm not too worried about that Miner. I'm gonna take that, and then we'll get in there. Oh, no, 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 no! No! No, don't kill... Oh, dang it. Dang, dude. Why you gotta kill my hog like that? I was waiting forever to throw him in there. Let's go... Oh, we need a hog rider hit. Let's go goblins in the back. Okay. We can do this, guys. We can do this. We gotta focus just two seconds. Boom, 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 boom. No! <laughs> of course he's got that. We're never gonna get a hog to the tower, are we? I don't care. I don't really care. <laughs> the thing is, he doesn't have... What are you going to do with that? What are you going to do with that? Okay, now we got this. We got this in the back. Watch this. Watch this. No! <laughs> no. 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 Yes. <laughs> no. <laughs> don't go back there. I may have I may have overspent my elixir just real quickly there, but I'm okay with it. Um, let's go... What are we going to do? What are we going to do? What are we going to do? Okay, so... As you can see, um, this is absolutely insane that I cannot win a match. Come on. Boom. One hit away? One hit away. Oh my gosh. This is insane, right? So, hold on. Hold on here. Yeah, I feel better. We got this, right here. Match number three. We're gonna pull out number three. Super jacked up about this. <clears throat> Focus. We didn't lose to Mega Knight Pekka, just so you know. Actually, this deck has been great against Mega Knight Pekka, just so you guys know, just a heads up. It has done extremely well. Um, that bomb tower is going to be super annoying to deal with, but we're going to go ahead and save our hog for a little bit when we get a lightning. That's what we're going to do. We're going to go, boom. We're going to go Mega Minion over here just so he doesn't hit those other little minions. Um, Mega Minion should be able to take that out. Just split. Oh, so he's got a little bit of a minion horde coming in thing. We're going to go Ice Golem. Right. No? Did we miss it? Yep, we missed it, of course. <laughs> Why wouldn't we? Let's go Hog Rider now and see if we can't get a Mega Minion in here to take out that bomb. Oh. I swear, everybody's rolling. Barbarian Horde 2 is like the... <laughs> Barbarians. Barbarians are like the worst thing ever for this deck, too. Like, the worst. 
Like, there is nothing worse. And then that baby dragon would take out my Pekka. No problem. No problem. Actually, we might get a swing or two off. What? That is insane. I should have zapped. I didn't realize we'd even get one swing off, so I should have zapped and we would have got two swings off. My bad. Um, tower will take out that baby dragon. Now we just gotta worry about... Um, what are we gonna worry about? Bomb tower. That's the problem. So he's got minion horde. Oh crap. Minion horde. Oh crap. We're gonna go like this. Boom, boom. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Um, let's go like this. There we go. And of course, of course, of course he has Barbarian Horde back in cycle. Of course. <laughs> Why? I should have just done something differently. Um, we should be able to stop those with just like some goblins though, so we're okay with that. And then he'll throw down. Okay, that's good. That's a good move. That's a good move. We're gonna go like that. Boom, boom. Perfect. Um, we did waste arrows there, so that's great. And then we'll probably get a couple hits off with our hog. Maybe. Oh, no, just one hit. Just because. Oh, so close to two hits, dude. So close to two. But our mini Pekka is gonna go do damage on this tower. Watch this. One, two, three shots. Come on. Baby, three shots. Come on. Show me the money. I can't believe this. This is great. We're doing okay. We're doing okay, guys. We're gonna pull this together. That drink of water. What am I what am I doing dropping mini pack over here? <laughs> I'll tell you what. We're gonna rock this guy's world right here. Boom, boom, boom. Where's his bomb power anyway? What is he doing? He's totally ignoring the laws of physics over here. He just basically said goodbye to that tower over there. Which I'm okay with, 100%. You can say goodbye to that tower, whatever you want. Holy cow, we're gonna pull out a win finally after 14 games of misery. This is nuts. This is nuts. I don't even know what it's like to win anymore. What do I do? I get a chest? I get a chest, I think. This is grand. Oh, a golden chest of all chests to get. That is marvelous. I worked so hard for that victory. How many did I lose? Oh my gosh. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, nine, ten, eleven. Almost tw eleven defeats. One victory. Keep in mind, now that was against Pekka Mega Knight. And this other Pekka Mega Knight we did draw against. So take that for what it's worth with this deck. Anyway, thank you guys so much for dropping by the channel today. Keep up the good work. Make sure you keep your heads cool when you guys lose so you guys don't have any problems in real life or in game. And keep up the good work. Good luck. <laughs>